Hi everyone and thank you so much for stopping by my channel today. So today I thought I would start my first ever um, product review video. Um, I'm starting off with this uh, Jax Linseed Studio Soap. It's a soap that's meant to uh, clean brushes that um, use uh, either acrylic paint or oil paint or any kind of um, paint on. And it's supposed to be a really good product and I'm really excited to try it out. And so the big reason why I bought this is because um, I've been having some trouble with using my oil painting brushes because a while back, um, actually I think it's like been several months at this point, um, I had stored my brushes along with my little bottles of oil and my linseed oil bottle sprung a leak and my brushes got completely covered with oil. And I've been trying my best to get the oil out, but as you can see from my fan brush here, um, you can't really tell by looking at it, but like if you try, like these brushes are supposed to be really, really flexible, and like just see that it's like really they're still really like stuck together and um, they're stained blue. And I think this was actually white when I bought it, but now it's gone to like this yellowy color, and it's just it's really stiff and hard to work with. And then with my other brushes as well, like I can't even get the bristles apart very well, um, and so these really took a hit with this little uh, linseed oil incident um, and so usually I can bring them back to life after I stir them around in my paint thinner a bit but then once it comes to like storing them they always like go back to this really hard um, chunky consistency and so now when I try to oil paint sometimes um, like the paint won't really flow off of them really well like my brushes get just get really really stiff and and it's just not a good thing. And on top of that, I've also been commissioned to do um, a special little painting this weekend, and so I really need to get my brushes back in order. And so um, I am going to go ahead and use this soap to clean them. So the first thing that, um, so on the jar it says um, if the brushes are hardened, you should soak them overnight in a 50-50 um, dilution with water. So. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna just have to soak these overnight somehow, some way, and um, then clean them off tomorrow after they've soaked for 24 hours, and then hopefully we'll see where that goes. Okay, so I'm gonna go and set up my overnight soak, and I will get back to you in a little bit. Okay, so here's my little soaking setup. Um, I'm just using about an inch of water or so in um, some of these plastic lids from uh, disposable cake pans. And so I decided to do it this way because it, I'm trying to prevent any damage to the glue on the brushes because if you soak them, if you like completely soak them in water then um, the glue on the brushes will like disintegrate and then like the metal part will pop off and then the bristles will fall apart and it's just, it's just not a good thing. Um, and so yeah, um, I, I put a really decent amount of the soap into the water just because like I mentioned before. Um, a lot of these brushes are like completely caked with oil and I actually did a little um, like pre-wash of a couple of brushes that were really far gone and so far this stuff seems to be working pretty well. Um, as you can see I've used quite a bit of it so far. Um, I've been reading online that you don't really need to use a whole lot when you're just doing your regular cleanings but I figure that since this is a big soaking um, I'd be better off just using a lot right from the get-go. So. All right, so we have our soak all set up and now we wait 24 hours. All right, so now that everything is all said and done, I'm going to wrap up this review. I am very, very happy with this stuff. Um, this got out most, if not all, of that old oil and old paint that I've been sitting in my brushes. Um, just to give you just an example of my fan brush. Now it's still um, stained blue, but I really don't think there's much you can do about that at this point. Um, but the bristles are just so much softer now and they're not like all stuck together like they were before like it almost feels like it's back to brand new and this is another one that was really bad too like it was just like hard as a rock and you could not get the brushes to come apart but now just just look at that look at that there most of them are basically back to normal um there were a couple that were I think they were a little bit too far gone to be saved like this one um I mean it's not as bad as it was but even so it's still like very like the the bristles still kind of feel a bit tacky um so i may just give this a rewash and just see if that helps at all um but this one in particular had a ton of oil stuck in it and that was my fault that wasn't the fault of this stuff obviously um so yeah i'm gonna say that i absolutely recommend this stuff especially if you're a little bit lazy like me and um don't 
wash your brushes right away. Um, I know it's a habit that I really need to break, um, but I'm very happy that I found this stuff because this really saved me a lot of time and a lot of money, and I don't need to go back and buy new brushes anymore. <laughs> So yeah, if you need a product that is going to clean out your brushes, especially if you have old paint sitting in there, old oil paint or something like that, get yourself a jar of this stuff. I believe it's only $8 on Amazon, and I'll leave a link down below. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my review. I hope you found this helpful and informative, and I will see you in the next video.